What lad, what's the crack? My name is Orgy Runner and welcome back to Dead Space. Uh, right, if I unpause the game, we're going to see something uh, a bit peculiar. Well, uh, the first thing that's peculiar is these body bags flipping out. I don't know what the hell is going on with this. I've no idea. I just loaded into the game and they were spazzing out like this. And also, I managed to get 60 FPS working. Look at that. Oh, Jesus Christ almighty. No, 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 no. I, I can't cope with this. This is way. This is way too weird. Uh, no, okay. I'm gone. Should be clear from there to the morgue. Remember, the codes are on the captain's body. Yeah, I've no uh, idea what the hell is going on inside that thing. What? Yeah, so anyway, yeah, got 60 FPS working, and it turned out it was a lot simpler than, than I thought. It was V-Sync. V-Sync, I had no idea capped the frame limit. I thought it was something that just... Okay, that is not a happy sound. I, mean, I thought V-Sync was just something that fixed screen tearing. Okay, so we're going into the Ishimura Clinic. There's all sorts of happy things going on in here, I bet. Lots of graffiti as well. Sorry, we are full. Oh, I bet you are full of shit, probably. Give me that ammo. Yes, he is in this a lot better. 60 FPS makes every game a lot better. I mean, kind of. It's visually appealing is what I'm trying to say. Whoa, wait, hey, whoa, 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 what on earth? Oh, it's those things again. Ah, okay, well, I, I know one thing that's going to clear the room. Oh, no, 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 don't be shooting your projectiles at me. How do I switch weapons? Here we go. This is what I want You still here buddies? Ow, 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 ow And you're being a bit too loud for my liking Speaking of too loud, you gotta turn down the volume Okay, that's a little too low or too low. There we go. I think that's perfect. Okay. And as you can hear, oh, oxygen recharge. Don't need it because I got plenty of that stuff. What do we have going on inside here? Oh, credits. Give me those. Oh, more credits. Thank you. Here I am, a lowly space engineer turned thief. I have no respect for anyone, not even the dead. So I have to go out that door there, right, right, yeah, I do, I do but I have to find the power brick. Ah, there it is. But firstly, I just want to make sure I've collected everything here. Keep, I keep stamping on the ground. I don't mean to do that. Yeah, I'm not going out there just yet. Ooh, line racks. So, that's ammo for a gun, which I don't have yet. I know what gun it is. Jay, is everything so freaking loud in here? Ooh, more credits. Yes, give me those. Um, where's the power brick? Here it is. Whoopsies, did not mean to do that. Okay, so if I just put that in here. Easy. Oh. Wow! Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, yeah. Uh, I tell you, don't be scuttling off. Yeah, you go and show yourself, coward. Uh, 
Could you hold still and show your tentacles? Yeah, that's the ooh, yeah, that's the money shot I was going for. I totally meant to go for that, by the way. It, it was all skill. And yes, by the way, I am beat red, by the way, in the board. It's not holy mother of Karen's. No, I don't believe you're dead. Okay, now you're definitely dead. I truly believe Necromorphs, they're like a form of Karen transformation. And believe me, I know all about Karen's work in retail. Because I'm fully expecting a Karen to either go full fucking Super Saiyan on my ass from denying her entitlement, or just completely transforming into a Necromorph. And chopping my head off. Oh, hey, buddy. <gasps> oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Wow! 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 You're not dead, are you? Still don't believe you. Okay, now you're definitely dead. <gasps> what a coward! I know that's exactly what you're thinking. the hell did the other freaking things come from? The Necromorphs, there's one ahead of me, then next thing I know there's one behind me. Huh, okay. Okay, let's take a nice and easy breezy, lads, okay? Unlike you, I do feel like keeping all my limbs attached to my torso. Hey oh anybody here? I wish you didn't ask me that. Hello? Can anybody hear me? My name is Eileen Fitz. I just woke up in here and everybody was gone. I don't know what's happening. Why did they all leave? I'm going to try and find someone. If you can hear this, please come for me. I can hear scratching in the wall. Mm. Hello? Who's there? Are, are you a doctor? Why is everyone wait? I know you. You're Harris, the prisoner from the colony. You killed that nurse. Help! Somebody help me! Please! Please! Oh, well, I guess that's the end of her. Now, which way is optional? This way? Or that way? What on earth is going on here? What sort of madness... Are you fucking partaking in? Alrighty then. That was fun. Ooh, text log. From Dr. Kine, Chief Science Officer, to Captain Matthias Benjamin. Benjamin, further to our previous conversation, I ask that you delay bringing the marker up from the planet for a day or two. You know I'm as keen as anyone to study it in detail, and I understand your sense of urgency, given the events on the Connolly. But that's why I ask. What's happening down there is just too unique, too unprecedented. To cut it short without proper time to study the causes and effects. In light of a discussion I had with Dr. Mercer, I'd like to meet up with Dr. S uh, Scalario. Scalario? Scalario? I'm, I'm not sure how to pronounce that. And Willand, planet side, to get their observation. Observation, sorry. Terrence. Oh. Okay, okay. Well, uh, I'm. I'm Oh, that's sad. Right, so I'm just gonna go back out here. Yeah, whatever collectibles I have to get. And probably have a few more necromorphs jump out at me. Guess that's normally the way it goes. Oh, buddy, you've seen better days. 
Oh, wait for it now. Something scary is going to jump up from there. I just know it. Oh, yeah. Call it. Oh, <gasps> shit. Shit. Christ. Oh, I did call it. I knew it was going to happen. Okay, that was just too obvious. Yeah, you're definitely down for the count now. Newborns. Oh, no. Alyssa Rose, Kai, Jatin, Alyssa, Leone, Ian Ansel, Jackson, Thomas, Lucas... Sarah James, Caitlin, Kai Joshua, Cody, Kyle, Gianna Faith, Jack William, Agatha, uh, Mara Joy. Oh, these are all. These are all babies that were turned into that morphs. Jesus, that is grim. That's as grim as all hell. Jesus, leave the children out of it for Christ's sake. Hey, got my eye on you. Oh, I, I, I don't like that. I don't like when babies are involved. I mean, sure, it adds a, a bit of shock factor, but sometimes they can go too far. Ooh, save station. How long have I been recording? It's only about, what, 10, 15 minutes? Um, ba -ba 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 -boom. Yeah, there, they're about. So I'm going to try, try and keep this video a little shorter. Because, you know, I think an hour of content is too much. Well, depending on... Depending on the game. Science Log, Chief Science Officer Dr. Kine reporting. The colony's problems concern me greatly. I have no doubt they are somehow linked to the discovery of the marker. But the exact nature of that connection is still unknown. Almost 40% of the colonists are experiencing a form of dementia. The obvious symptoms are acute depression, insomnia, and hallucination. Incidents of violence and even murder also indicate extreme paranoia. Dr. Mercer has advised that I bring some of the affected on board for study. Dr. Wellen, the planet side psychiatrist, has reported that his own analysis has been fruitful. I'm hesitant to rely on Dr. Mercer at this point, but I need his expertise. We need solutions. And we need them quickly. Yeah, but I don't think we're getting any solutions anytime soon, buddy. Now, I wonder if this Dr. Kind guy, is he still alive? Maybe, maybe not. Oh! More fun things here. Lovely. Oh. <gasps> Jesus Christ. Wait, that's the captain. I need him. And you've decided to devour his entire body. Is this going to be a boss fight? It probably is going to be a boss fight. Slow it down. Treatment. Whew. That was a lot easier than it ought to be. And they look good. Thank God. I'll start accessing the captain's records right now. Head to the tram station and I'll contact you there. I'm going to find out what the hell happened to the ship. Okay, so how did he die? So this is the autopsy report. Dr. Thomas G. 
medical examiner. It is my sad duty to officially pronounce Captain Benjamin Matthias dead. Reports of the exact circumstances surrounding his death are conflicted and beyond the scope of my role. I can only report on the body. The subject was in generally good health for his age, though a cursory blood test indicates his leukocyte count was very low, with eosinophils in particular almost non-existent. His pre-flight physical exam showed no such problems indicating rapid onset, however it is unlikely this had any effect on his death. Multiple contusions on the arms and hands indicating a brief struggle free mortem, slight contusion around the ribcage suggesting his chest was restrained in some way. The cause of death was a single prolonged trauma to the ocular body which continued on through the cavity wall and finally into the frontal lobe causing rapid neurotrauma seizure and death oh, okay so I think he was stabbed in the face is what they're trying to say Ooh, return to the emergency room I can can I actually go through there well I suppose I can because it's open also, I'm taking these credits and I'm going to take what's ever lying around here thank you and a power node, lovely. Thanks for making it worth my while. Can I smash this? No, I can't. Uh. Oh, oh. Wait, did I see something flash up here? Yeah, I did. Oh, oh Jesus! So, gotta be careful with these things. These doodads, doohickeys, they actually turn their bodies into the necromorphs. So now where is this going to take me? Is it just going to loop around or what? Wait, do I know this area? No, I don't. Oh, yeah, it's just in here. That was not a happy noise. Oh, I knew it. Was it just to one of you? Uh, not liking these uh, ambient sounds. <gasps> I said like that before. Isaac, Fuck me. Somehow one of them found a way down to the captain's nest. I managed to contain it in a damaged escape pod. Lifting executive lockdown now. I found the deck logs. Whatever is happening around here, it came from the planet when they cracked it open. It spread to the colony and reached the ship. Isaac, this isn't an infection. It's some form of alien life. <laughs> Shit, we've got bigger problems. The ship's engines are offline and our orbit is decaying. Get over to the engineering deck ASAP while I stay here and figure out what the problem is. Okay, okay, I will do that. <gasps> Jesus. This is Senior Medical Officer Nicole Brennan transmitting ship wide. We need more help. We don't have the resources to deal with this many cases. Nobody would tell us what's happening. These wounds. We are not equipped to deal with this. <sighs> Get him to the table. Hold him. Nurse, you hold him down. <sighs> That was Nicole, right? I can't tell from here when that log was made. I'm sure she's around here somewhere. And I'm sure she's dead. Right, so where to now? Back the way I came. Right, so I've been recording for about 20 minutes there, thereabouts, I think. I think I've done it done enough for one video. I want to try and keep them shorter just to see how it, it affects, you know, the click-through rate. Just want to try various things on the channel. Now the only 
game I will record for an hour or more is um, Life is Strange 2. Because nobody wants a series dragged out in teeny tiny parts and, and Life is Strange is just a series that should be completed in about... Well, each episode should be completed in about two or three videos. Three max, because I've never done four videos on one episode. It's been two or three max, but I think it's been three consistently, so that's the way it's going to be. So there's probably going to be three more videos or two more videos of Life is Strange episode two, which I've got to get recording after this, and three more videos of part three, part four, and then part five. Can't wait to see where I get with that game. Anyway, I think I will leave this video here and stop rambling. Or wait. Man, I've been recording for about 24 minutes, but I'm uh, I'm not sure. I'm still not sure. Uh, you know what? Fuck, uh, I think I'll continue on to this next save point just to see what happens. Or I might just take the train somewhere and see if it'll automatically save and speaking of which see what I can do here okay I don't think I need a medium air can line racks I don't really no I don't want to sell these I want to move them to my safe pulse rounds yeah um, small med pack I'll move it Uh, line gun, I have enough credit for it and a flamethrower as well. Archivite or a power node, do you want? Know I'm gonna buy the line gun. Flamethrower seems more enticing. You know what? I haven't come across any rounds for the flamethrower, so yeah, line gun it will be. There's no deck here for upgrading the the pulse rounds or the weapon I currently have on me. Yep. Okay, so where to now? Do I get to choose where? Okay, so that is chapter complete, so I think I might as well call it a video and just get to the next save point. Which is here, save my progress, but I'll get to a save station. You got two problems, and we're working on borrowed time here. First, there's no fuel in the engine. Second, the gravity centrifuge is offline, which means there's a couple of trillion tons of rock pulling us down. I need you to get that centrifuge operational. Refuel the main engine and fire it up so I can stabilize the ship's orbit. Okay, we heard the uh, captain, or he's not the captain, but he's he's the lieutenant or the leader of this uh, motley crew. Even there's only, even if there's only two of us left. Okay, right. I just want to find the next save point. That's all I want to do. That's all I want to do. It's all I want to do. Oh, there it is. But first, just gather what's ever here. Yes, give me all of those. Ooh, we can get ourselves some sorty pop. And ooh, audio log. I'll listen to this. Acting Chief Engineer Jacob Temple. It's been two days since they pulled that planet open, since the captain died. The panic, the riots, they were nothing compared with what came after. Our friends, our co-workers started coming back. Changed, coming back to kill us, drag us away. Rucker disappeared this morning, and I have to assume he's dead. My crew, they're starting to crack. I'm trying to keep an eye on them, but right now I have bigger problems. We're hemorrhaging fuel, and the primary engine is laboring. Danvers and I are going to try to reach the fuel depot to see if we can fix it. Temple out. You know what? I'm kind of zoning out during all these audio logs. 
Because I have a fair idea what happened. Because I think I I may have watched two Dead Space movies. Not that long ago, in fact. I think it's actually what inspired me to replay the game again. Because there's a prequel movie to the first game. And then there's another prequel movie to the second game. So yeah, they're both... They're both prequels. We have a, pre a prequel to the first game, then a prequel to the to the sequel of, of the main game. <laughs> that makes sense. But, uh, yeah. It basically summed up the game for me. Like, the, the marker is what's causing everyone to transform. Kind of. And then these alien life formers got on board somehow and then attacked everybody on the spaceship and in the colony below and transformed them into these monsters or Karens as I would call them because every day I see a Karen in work I don't know, she just, they just remind me of necromorphs except without the extra appendages but then again they've never shown me their final form well, bar that, that one who was stalking me around the store at one stage in a way, that's enough of my own personal life, and I will leave this video here. Definitely this time. <laughs> Definitely. So, guys, you know what to do? If you did enjoy this video, God, my background looks dark. Got dark pretty quick, and my forehead is getting even redder. <laughs> okay, but seriously, guys, you know what to do? If you did enjoy this video, be sure to give it a massive thumbs up, come favorite, share it with your friends, and of course, like always, I will see you guys in the next one.